We begin at five with a tragic update. The baby at the center of an alleged child abuse case in Canyon City has died. New court documents obtained by 13 investigates reveal the man charged in his death told police he disciplined the baby the same way he treated his dog. Investigative reporter Quinn Ritzdorf is live from Children's Hospital in Colorado Springs where the baby was being cared for. Quinn. The boyfriend of the baby's mother will likely face new charges after the 10 month old Edward Hayes died here at the Children's Hospital earlier this morning. This arrest affidavit sheds light on the details leading up to the baby's death. 21 year old William Jacobs was left to take care of Hayes at the Motel 6 in Canyon City when his girlfriend and the mother of the child went to work. The arrest affidavit says Jacobs told police he was changing the baby's diaper when he went stiff and made gargling noises. Jacobs says he shook and slapped the baby on the back to get him to breathe. A nurse in the next door room heard what was happening and called 911. She says Jacobs was being too rough with the baby. When police responded, the baby was unresponsive and taken to the hospital. We interviewed him and, and several family members and and uh, subsequently established that you know he was he was the uh, sole adult caretaker um, at the time the child was became unresponsive. In an interview with detectives, Jacobs admits hitting the baby's head on a door frame and playfully biting his arm a few days earlier. He says he disciplined the 10 month old the same way he disciplined his dog by lightly throwing him on the bed. The detective says Jacobs was constantly changing his story during the interview and acting nervous. Jacobs was arrested and charged with felony child abuse. Canyon City Police say those charges will likely increase because Hayes has died. We're going to have to discuss with the uh, district attorney, but yes, I'm certain that the, the, the charging determination would, would uh, equal the uh, result. Jacobs was initially held without bond until yesterday when it was set at $75,000 cash only. An autopsy on the baby tomorrow morning will give more insight into how he died. Reporting live in Colorado Springs, Corner at Storf, 13 Investigates.